Today we're opening a first edition hobby box of Soul of the Duelist to get that ultimate rare horse. What's up guys, we're back with another video and today I have this hobby box because I've opened one of these before and we did really, really badly. But I once did buy Horus level four, six and eight, all in ultimate rare first edition near mint. I bought them from a friend of mine. He sent them to me, this was in like 2018 and they got lost in the mail and I have not owned the three of those in first edition since. So the goal is to get the big level eight. I mean, level six would be awesome as well. Level four is in a retail box so we can't get it. But the goal is to get level eight ultimate rare. If we got six and eight both, that'd be insane. So we're hoping that happens in this video we also have a few other packs to open but first we have a giveaway i'll be giving away this battles of chaos first edition booster box all you have to do is like this video be subscribed turn on notifications and let me know will we get the horus this is a very difficult pull so if we do pull it we're losing it. it's one of our best pulls of all time i'm i'm just envisioning it right now it's gonna happen and now a word from our sponsor this video is sponsored by bespoke post bespoke post is a monthly membership club delivering awesome boxes of top shelf goods from under the radar brands it's free to join and you can skip a month or cancel anytime every month we introduce our members to cool new products outdoor gear barware home and kitchen goods clothing and more based on preference quiz that they fill out every box has around 70 dollars worth of goods inside but costs you only a fraction of the value You'll get a box assigned to you, and before it's even shipped, you get to decide if you want to keep it, swap it for another box, or just skip the month entirely. For no charge, by the way. You only pay for what you want. For my first box, I got the Weekender. This box contains a hard-wearing carry-all that will be awesome for when I travel to tournaments and Collecticon events. In my second box, I got the Forge. This box contains a knife that withstands the test of time. I am constantly opening boxes, and my current knife has not held up well, so I knew this would be perfect. If you guys are interested in something like what I've gotten, check out Bespoke Post. To get 20% off your first box, click the link in the description and use code RUXIN20 or check out bespokepost.com slash RUXIN20. Thanks again to Bespoke Post for sponsoring this video. All right, let's get this thing opened up. Thank you guys so much for being here, checking out the channel today. Um, I'm hoping that we can give you guys an amazing pull. I'm really... Uh, that was not how I meant to open that, but it worked out, I guess. First edition Soul of the Duelist. The last time I opened this was like three years ago and out of a booster box, I think. No, maybe we did. Did we do a booster box opening? I think it was unlimited though, right? So we have all of these packs. We're going to shuffle them up. We're going to make it interesting. We're going to try and pull something amazing. And it's not just a booster box opening today, guys. We have other boxes as well, or other packs as well, not boxes. I'll show you guys what we have. All right, we're going to open some. I have a few more packs of Dimensions for us, so we're hopefully going to pull the Starlight Ghost Bell out of here because we never did pull it, or any of the Therion stuff is very good. We'll take that. There's a Therion right of the way. We've got the Divine Dragon. We've got the Scare Claw. Heroic Champion. We've got the Therion Disc Coliseum right off the bat and Ultra Rare. We will take that. This was supposed to be on the weekend, but we had a sponsor on this video, so sometimes that get, makes it slow down or whatever, but hopefully you guys enjoy this um, weekend video, not on the weekend. So <laughs> let me know in the comments if you do. we got the Proxy Horse and the Go. DDD Divine King Rage. Very nice. And then we also have some hobby packs of Power of the Duelist. So we're not just opening Hobby Soul of the Duelist. We're opening Power of the Duelist as well. And you guys know, those green uh, of the Duelist sets, they have some pretty good cards inside. So maybe today will be the day we get some insane pulls. I'm down for that to happen. I'm excited for it. Let's see what we can get. Miracle Jurassic Guy. We've got the Crop Circles. Fake Hero. Chrysalis Dolphin. We've got the Paths of Destiny. Ambulance Rescue Roid. Contact. And the Alien Mother. The Mother of Aliens. And the Decoy Roid. Okay. So, dud start, but that's okay. Let's go into our first pack here. The cards that I want out of here, any of the Ultra Ultis are amazing. Like, the one with the Red Eyes on it, what's it called? It's like, it's Red Eyes' attack. It's like Burst Stream Destruction, but for Red Eyes. What is it called? I can't remember what it's called, but it's a really beautiful card as well. Ultimate Rare. Then there's, of course, the Horus. There is the... I think a Mystic Swordsman or something like that. There's, what's the other one? I'm forgetting the other one. It's really cool as well. We got a Heavy Slump. Let's see what we can pull. We got an Element Soldier. The Graveyard in the Fourth Dimension. Taunt. We got... Wait, did you guys see this? A little bit of a print dot right there. Like a weird dot. We got the Red Eyes Beat Chick. The Level Up. This used to be like a couple bucks. I don't think it is anymore. It's had a couple of reprints, but still cool. Nobleman Eater Bug. I actually played this in the Junior Journey series. You guys can go check that out on MBT's channel. Uh, Mystic Swordsman level 2. This is a really good retail ultimate rare because, you know, people play this in, like, their warrior goat decks. Very cool. Very, very cool. I think Sasuke Samurai is also a... No. Grandmaster Sasuke is also a rare. There we go. He is also a good retail ulti. The retail ultis in here are actually not that bad. I mean, a lot of them are pretty decent. There's, like, Ojama King. There's Grandmaster of Oz. A lot of cool ones. DD, DD Savant Copernicus. I mean, I can't speak. Galaxy Soldier. That's how it always starts. When it's my first video recording of the day, it's just like, uh, I mean, sometimes I do one, sometimes I do multiple. The mul the second or third one, I'm usually a lot better. But the first one, I am struggling. Let's see what we can do. We got the Scareclaw, Divine Dragon, Therion. 
got the former pal Lady Ainge. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Not too crazy, but uh, we'll take it. Next up, we're going to go Ghost from the Past 2. You guys know we're not going to really get tired of Ghost from the Past 2 for a while. I don't know about you guys, but I'm still not tired of it. It's always fun to open Despia. Fossil Warrior Skull Knight. Very cool. All right. Let's go back into Power of the Duelist. Let's see if we can get an ultimate. Last time we opened these on a video is a maybe a week ago or so. We didn't get anything. So I'm hoping that that means that these have something. We can pull something amazing because, I mean... Chimera Tech Overdragon. I am interested in that in Ultimate Rare. I still don't own it, so let's see if we can pull it. We got the uh, Common Soul. We got the Destiny Hero Blade Master. Alien Mother, not Hunter. No, Hunter. Mother was the one we pulled earlier. D Spirit. Wonder Garish. Alien Grey. Synthetic Seraphim. And a Neo Space. Man, another good retail. Well, wait, this is POTD. POTD just has a lot of good Ultimate Rares. And by good, I mean, like, they are pretty. You know, like, like Neo Space is not a good card, but it's a pretty card. And it's collectible because it's Neos. So that's that's what I mean. Not Definitely not good in terms of, like, actual playability. Let's see if we can pull something insane out of here. I think it's the it's four from the back where we're going to do three. We got a Malice Doll of Demise. That's another dot that's not coming off. We got the Gorgon's Eye. This has it, too. Look, there's dots everywhere. Look at that. I remember last time I opened this booster box, the ultra rare was bent. I remember that. So hopefully that doesn't happen again. In range Mooka Mooka, the uh, quality control was not great back then either. Still not great today. So mind crush. We got a mind wipe back to back. The mines are being crushed and wiped. We got the red eyes beat chick. Skull dog Marin and what will it be? Uh oh. Master of Oz, there he is, the legend. 4,200 was always pretty legendary because of how like massive his stats are. Really cool to see that guy. I don't really understand like what is he he's a giant kangaroo why is he green though i i don't know i really don't either way we're taking that pull that's pretty amazing let's see what else we can get i don't know uh if i keep opening a pack every seat like three packs every time we open one of the booster box okay there's a cursed dragon the magical dragon we're gonna be here for a long time so maybe i shouldn't do that but i'm having too much fun it's gonna be a long video potentially let's see let's see what we can do here we got a uh, chronicle magician very nice and let's go into power of the duelist i just want to pull something cool today i don't know about you guys i just really like i'm feeling pulling something cool so i'm just opening a lot to make sure we can you know get something interesting let's see we got elemental hero neos already nice mausoleum we got a bit long ambulance rescue roid we got the elemental hero neos d spirit the flying saucer musik the baby source, nice, or Sarasaurus, and then the Gangadiel and the Destiny Mirage. Because so far we have not pulled anything too crazy. We pulled a couple of decent cards. Let's see if Soul of the Duelist can change that. A whole booster box we are opening today. First edition. Pretty amazing. Pretty awesome. This set, I think, is the 12th set. It came out right after Anxious Sanctuary, if I'm correct. So, yeah, really old set. First set, I believe, that they stopped using secret rares and started using ultimate rares. So pretty awesome. Big wave, small wave, hit up. Really the first ultimate rare set. That's actually crazy. I didn't think about that. Element Dragon with the heavy slump. Arm Dragon level 3, Mind Wipe, Mind Crush, Dark Mimic level 1, also not a terrible card, it's kind of like a uh, Dekoichi, but worse, and, because Dekoichi wasn't out yet when this came out. Oh, another Mystic Swordsman level 2, not a bad card either, and then a Mass Dragon, also a pretty decent card. Alright, next up, Ghost from the Past 2, also, don't forget to check out my Twitch channel, I've been streaming 5 days a week, every weekday, so go check it out, link in the description, we've been doing a lot of cool stuff over there. Let's get back to the opening. Let's go. Sanctuary. We got the nine pillars. Christron Halka Fibrax. Mention Twitch. You pull Christron Halka Fibrax. Good sign, I think. Maybe we should mention every pack. No, we won't. We won't do that. Okay. Dimension Force. I think we're going to lower it to like one or two packs per Soul of the Duels pack. So we're not opening like a million packs. <laughs> oh, we messed it up. Libra Mancher Bonded. That was a mini Ruxin special. Not a full Ruxin special, though. So that's okay. Let's go on to Soul of the Duelist. We have opened a few packs so far. We are Ofer on this box. So we've got a ways to go to actually pull something good. All right. Dark Mimic level one. Let's see. We have Neo Aquamador. We have Enraged Muka Muka. The Dark Fact of mass production all right that's for the exodia limbs the dark mimic level one the howling insect not a bad card either then did you art of decoy we got the hate hane also tried to play this in the uh, uh junior journey and a green no, <laughs> no not the green ultimate rare again no why guys we pulled this last time the greed ultimate rare last time was worth like two dollars it's probably worth a little bit more but also this box costs a lot more than it cost me last time so <sighs> all right i still have hope i still have hope we are gonna pull something good out of the other ultimate rare and we're gonna get a good ultra rare we're gonna get a horse okay i believe it's gonna happen please let's check out that we need to check out the condition on the back of that to see if if we do pull an ultimate it's gonna be a nice condition or at least a good one royal writ of taxation that is really depressing alien skull rallis i pulled that last time crowd the Chrysalis Dolphin, the Black Terra, Black Saucer, the Paths of Destiny, and 
D-Chain. Okay, D-Chain, Saber Source. All right, let's check out the back. These are always in terrible condition. Okay, yeah, there's... It's actually not that bad, but it has some scuffing there. It's kind of like goes for the past. Wait, is this dinged? The corner is bent. The corner is bent, and the back is not really that bad, but the corner is bent. Oh, my goodness. We got a greed that's not even in near mint shape. Oof. That's rough. All right, we need Ghost from the Past Pulse to Ghost Rare. I'm already sad now. I'm already sad. Come on, man. Why'd that have to happen? Why'd that have to happen? Rookie, we've got the uh, Deco Tiger Heat Soul. That's pretty good. Mystical Shine Ball and Infinity Sage. Okay, wait. I have more Ghosts from the Past. Wait, we opened all the Dimension of Chaos, or, I think. I think we opened all of them by accident. Not Dimension of Chaos. Banshee, that's pretty good. Uh, what is it called again? Dimension Force. There we go. All the same name. Very confusing. Let's go back to Soul of Duelist. Maybe that can bless us with a Horus, the Black Flame Dragon. Gotta believe. You gotta believe, guys. Here we go. Come on. Goblin Calligrapher. Calligrapher. That's not how you say that. Calligrapher. Horus Servant. We got the Taunt. Sandwich. We got the Fusion Weapon. Arm Dragon level 3. And... Horus the Black Flame Dragon level 6. Okay, it's not an ulti. This would be a really cool ulti. But it is a super rare. We will take that. That's... I mean, it's not redemption, but it definitely helps the box. Okay, super rare Horus the Black Flame Dragon. That's pretty. I mean, that looks nice. Honestly, this would be a cool card to grade. Okay, maybe there's a little bit going on right there, so maybe we won't. Speaking of that, I sent in like 200 cards. Yeah, 200 cards of PSA. I'm going to be making a video on Rux and Live talking about it, and there's going to be a pre-grade seeing what I sub. So if you guys want to see that, go check out Rux and Live down below in the description. Pretty cool. All right, Ghost from the Past. We'll take we'll take Horus. That's pretty good. So we've gotten two foils now out of that. That's not bad. All right, Time Thief. Not anything crazy. Let's go back to Soul of the Duelist because we have a lot of packs left here. Let's see what we can pull. What shall we pull then? We have Fusion Weapon. Opening these booster boxes, man. It can either crush you or really hype you up. You, know, you never really know. We got Element Soldier. We got the Heavy Slump. Fusion Weapon. We got the Skull Dog Marin. Arm Dragon Level 3. Cemetery Bomb. And... Hammer shot. The worst smashing ground. After, that came out after smashing ground, which is very odd, but they did it anyway. Ghost from the past two. I believe in you, Ghost from the past two. We can pull a ghost or blue eyes. That would that would that would make me a little happier. Let's go. We got this shell knight. Okay, that's not gonna help. Back to sod. Then we're gonna do a pot pack. P-O-T-D. <laughs> pot a pot -a pack. Let's do a pot a pack after this. I kinda like a pot a pack. That's kind of fun. Except you gotta say it really fast. We've got the dark mac dark mactory, a fast production. We've got the horse. <laughs> Mouse, okay, unshaven angler taunt. I don't know what's happening. Sandwich, fusion weapon, and... Ooh, another Horus, level four. So we are pulling the Horuses. Is this a sign? Will we pull the level eight? I'm going to put that over there because right now we have level four and level six. Neither are ultimate rare, but level eight could be. That'd be a cool way to level up. Have like a regular rare four, then like a super rare six, and then an ultimate rare. It could be also be an ultra, which would also make sense. But I think ultimate rare would be cooler. Let's just say that. Okay. Destiny Hero Defender, 2700 defense. Better than Big Shield Garna, sort of. Common Soul. We got the Destiny Hero Fearmonger. We got the Paths of Destiny. Orbital of Bombardment. Wonder Gettish. And spell calling. Okay, those are not doing so hot right now. Let's see if we can redeem ourselves with ghosts from the past. Let's go. Ghosts from the past. Vision Hero. We got the Retaliating Sea. We've got the Chronicle Magician. Okay, Vampire Takeover. Cool card, but uh, it's not a Ghost Rare, so maybe if they make a Ghost version, I'll care about it. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. I'm just kidding, Vampire Takeover. I love you, even though you're not a Ghost Rare. <laughs> yeah, we love you. We totally love you, Vampire Takeover. Definitely a big fan. All right, let's just keep going. Don't talk to Vampire Takeover anymore. All right, Heavy Slump. We got the uh, Neo Aqua Mandora. We got the Mooka Mooka. Oh, Rux and Special with the Howling Insect. The first one of the video. Not Well, we kind of had one earlier. Ninjutsu Art. We got the Hate Hain. Fusion weapon and the charcoal impachi. All right, a normal one star 2100 defender. Interesting choice. And this will also be an interesting choice when it has a blue eyes white dragon inside. We pulled Dark Magician Girl the other day. I'm ready for blue eyes. Nope, Sacred Water's in the sky. All right, now back to Soul of the Duelist. We're not even halfway through this box, by the way, so we might want to pick it up in terms of opening Sod, or you're going to be here all day, which, you know, that's fine with me, but uh, I know you guys got other stuff to do, so let's uh, let's get through it. We got the Neo Aquamandor. Let's pull the Horus Ultimate Rare Level 8. And then you guys can be like, all right, cool. Big Wave, Small Wave, another Ruxin Special. We got we to gotta fix that. Two-Man Cell Battle, the Sandwich, Unshaven Angler. And, oh, no, do, no, no, do not be the same box. If this is the same box, this is what we got an ultimate rare last time. So I'm already expecting that this is what we're going to pull. We're going to get another ultimate rare penumbral soldier lady. Please don't let that happen. Just please, come on, have mercy. Not the same box. Like, come on, anything but the same box, right? I mean, that shouldn't happen. That shouldn't happen, right? Right now, in the comments, send me some luck that we will not pull the penumbral soldier lady. Brainwashing me. We've got the Alien Hunter. We've got the Common Soul. Come on. 
Synthetic Seraphim. We got the Elemental Hero Neos. Unbottled Bombardment. Or blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Ultimate Tyranno! I always... Oh, yeah. This is not Soul of the Duelist. I, I forgot. Ultimate Tyranno. Super rare. This is a very cool Ultimate rare as well. We will take that. That's really, really nice. But um, this is what we're looking for. You see him back there? Hor they barely put him on there. I don't get why they have a window. Like, why is he not the whole thing? They're like, here's a window. Here's, like, part of Horus with Yugi's hair covering up his face. Really weird. It's a really strange choice. I don't know, but they went with it. They went with it. And can we pull something amazing? Here we go. Gorgon's Eye. We got the Element Dragon. Gravekeeper in the Fourth Dimension. Element Soldier. Hey and Hain. It's got, they've got stuff all over him. Ninjutsu Art of Decoy. Howling Insect. These are 60 card sets, by the way. That's why we're seeing the same comments so much. And level up and Rafflesia seduction Ooh, okay that is a really interesting card that we totally wanted to pull definitely wanted that card 100 percent all right ghost for a time baby uh vision hero ferris we'll take that all day that's pretty solid pretty solid now let's go potd here we go give us something good potd we have the Baby Sarasaurus, the Dinos, the pretty amazing cards. Here we go. Alien Skull, Royal Writ of Taxation, the Rallis, the Starbird, Sabersaurus, Baby Sarasaurus, the Contact, Contact Contract. We got the Chrysalis Dolphin and... And... Oh, Ultimate Rare, Neospatian, Flare Scarab. All right, that's pretty sick. I used to have this super rare card uh, back in the day. And, uh, yeah, it was one of the only cards I kept. I actually still have this card. I don't know why I kept it. I guess I thought it looked cool. Where'd that? I saw a little dimple or something. This card's really beautiful, though. That's a nice pull. We will take that. Look at him. He's, like, swaggy. Okay, is his hand on his hip, or is he just holding his hand? Kind of looks like he's, like, mm, mm, mm. Okay, no. Neospatian, Flare Square, square up. Very cool. Nice square up we got there. Very nice pull. All right, that's going to jumpstart this video. That's going to start the waterfall of epic pulls, I believe. I believe we can do this. Let's go. Give us something amazing. Horus the Black Flame Dragon. Ritual Weapon. Trojan Horse. Abyssal Designator. Ultimate Baseball Kid. Nice level up. We got the Arm Dragon level 3. The Mind Wipe. Mind Crush. And... Okay. Spirit Barrier. Uh, why do I think this has value for some reason? I don't know. But Spirit Barrier. Okay. We'll take that. We're going to go back to Ghost from the Past. We are almost 20 minutes into this video. I hope you guys are enjoying the long video. A lot of you guys say, I love the long videos. You guys say that every time I upload a long video. That might not be the majority of you, but some of you guys are saying that. So I really hope you do because this is a long one for sure. Let's see if we can speed it up a little bit. I say that as we're opening a pack that's not Soul of the Duelist. Uh, let's go like this. Uh, the packs are falling over. That's how many packs we've opened. Common Soul. Amulus Roy. Fake Hero. Baby Sarasaurus. Contact. And... No, it's not this one. Wonder Garage. It's not this one either. Rescue Rod. And... Oh, whoa! Back to back! Flare Scarab, there's the super rare. So we got the ultimate and the super rare in back to back packs. That's pretty weird. That actually does look really nice, though. We'll take that. Very nice. Okay, final pack on the right side. Soul of the Duelist. We might need to do like back to back Soul of the Duelist packs because we're getting a little carried away here. Let's see if we can pull something amazing. Can we pull... We haven't, we haven't pulled an Ultra out of here. You're not guaranteed to get one, so hopefully we will get an Ultra Rare, and it's a good one. We've got the Mouse Doll Demise, Gorgon's Eye, Mind Wipe, Red Eyes Be Chick, Skull Dog Marin, Unshaven Angler, and... Rafflesia Seduction. Yeah, he's at it again. Let's go to the first pack on the left side. So we pulled, what, an Ultra and one Super or something? Was that it? So we should have a lot on this side, potentially. Like, four or five pulls, I hope. I hope that we do, at least. Let's see if we can get a really good one. Abyssal Designator, Ultimate Baseball Kid, The Absolute End, Neo's Neo Aquamdor. We got the Nobleman Eater Buck, the Ninjutsu Art of Decoy, Howling Insect, Level Up, and Spirit Barrier is added again. So we got another one of those, another Spirit Barrier. Ghost from the Past is about to bring it back from the Spirit World. Here we go, because he's a ghost. He's a uh, he's blue eyes. Let's see what he can do. The Sacred Waters in the Temple. That is not what we're looking for. Now we give it to Pot, the Potted. We got an ultimate rare out of here today, which is pretty amazing. Can we get a second one? Huh? Be pretty good. Be pretty good. We've already gotten two ultimate pulls in today's video. One we wanted, the other one we did not. We have a bit long. Decoy Roid, the Mausoleum of the Emperor, the Miracle Jurassic Egg, D Spirit, Flying Saucer Musicle. We got the uh, Neos and Water Garage and alien warrior so a lot of aliens in that pack yeah very cool how many times have i said soul of the duelist in today's video i don't know i'm just trying to drive it home that we're about to pull the horse you know out of soul of the duelist and you're not gonna forget it because you're gonna be like dude he said soul of the duelist like a hundred times in today's video it's like yeah that's how we roll ritual weapon we got the mass dragon pretty cool card mall style of demise big wave small wave we got the arm dragon level three skull dog marin fusion weapon and 
Ultimate Insect Level 1. This is another beautiful ultimate in retail. We can't get that one. That's okay. Now let's go to the next pack. Let's see what we can pull. Will it be something amazing? I'm still on the edge of my seat. Will it be a repeat box like the one from three years ago? It's totally possible. Hopefully not, though. Gorgon's Eye. Someone is very loud outside with their truck. We had a ritual weapon. Maybe it's a motorcycle. We got a Dark Mimic Level 1. Mind Wipe. Hate Hane. Mind Crush. Another ultimate insect level one. Okay, back to back ultimate insects. That can happen. That is something that can happen. We are now going ghost from the past because we are still looking for a lot of stuff out of that box. We have a time thief. Okay, back to back, back to back ghost rares. That's what I'm feeling. Back to back ghost from the past. I think this might work. I think it might happen. Let's see. We got box of friends. We've got a luber. It worked. It worked. That wasn't a ghost share, but that was a good pull. We'll take it. Now pod, pod da -da -da. pull us another ultimate rare. You've had the best pull of the video, so can you do it again? We're doing four from the back now because we're confident in what it is. The Rallus. We got the Alien Skull. We got the Royal Ritz. Saber Saurus. Ambulance Rescue Roid. Alien Gray. Vehicoid Connection Zone. Fossil Activation. And Overload Fusion. Another beautiful retail. So many good ultimate rares out of Power of the Duelist. Hobby and retail. It's pretty nice. Back to Soul of the Duelist. I think we still need to pull a lot of foils. So I don't know where they are, what they're doing. I mean, I guess we'll find out. Let's see what we can do. One, two, three, four. We have Heavy Slump, Element Dragon, oh, Rux and Special again, Mass Dragon, the level up, Red Eyes Bee Chick, the Taunt, Unshaven Angler, and mine on air, believe it or not, my mind is on air. Let's go to the second one. There's still a lot of pulls left, supposedly, uh, and we're not seeing them. It's kind of weird. I feel like we've only pulled one super rare out of here. Well, no, two super rares. Two supers and ultimate. That's why. Okay, Goblin Calligrapher. We got the Mooka Mooka. I double Rux and special. Oh, is that a sign maybe? A good sign? Possibly. Maybe a bad sign. Red Eyes B Chick. Cemetery Bomb. And... It's the same box. No... No, this can't be happening. The same exact box from 2019, I think. Maybe 2018. Oh, come on. The worst ultimate rares in the set. Literally the worst possible ultimate rares. Oh my goodness. Now we just have to hope for a Horus ultimate rare. That's our only, or ultra rare, I should say. Because I don't think we can get another ultimate rare. Oh my, what a depressing box. What a depressing box. I'm really getting flashbacks right now. I'm getting flashbacks, guys. I'm really, I'm really feeling it. It's bad. This is not good. We have a Neo Aquamador. Absolute end. Just give us the level eight ultra at least. Come on. I remember we got the worst ultra rare last time too, and it was bent. Uh, Mind Crush and Null and Void. Yep, another another great super. That would have been a pretty bad super too, even though that would have looked cool, and at least I wouldn't have it. POTD, you've been the bright spot of this video. So continue to brighten this video up with another epic pull. Because right now, this video, I'm not gonna say it sucks, but you know, you know what I'm thinking. All right, fake here. We got the brainwashing beam, alien hunter, elements of Aeneas, board bombardment, bub, 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 bub. chrysalis dolphin, and destiny hero dasher. Used to be fifteen dollars, just got reprinted. It's probably one dollar now, unfortunately. Soul of the duelist. This is your chance. Okay, here's the better part. I don't think we pulled Horus level six last time, so we got a super rare that was better than last time. We can take that. That's better than being the exact same and just being awful. But uh, our luck with this set continues to be pretty poor. Element dragon. We've got the graveyard. I'll be happy if we get the level eight ultra. I'll be happy with that. Ninjutsu art. Howling insect. Ninjutsu, or Ninja, Grandmaster Sasuke. This is a good card in Warrior decks for GOAT as well. Ghost in the Past, this is your chance. This is your chance to really change the mood. Come on, cheer us up. Okay. Maybe like, uh, you know, by change the mood, I meant like give us something good, not like something boring. I mean, that's what I really meant by this. We have, uh, okay, Reptia Egg. All right, nice. Let's do one Power of the Duelist. And we're going to go back to Soul of the Duelist. We're going to finish out this box. We're going to pull the ult, or not the ultimate, the Horus Love Light. Maybe we'll pull the ultimate. Who knows? Maybe Error Box. We'll see if it can happen. Let's go. Ah, Emil Troy, Decoy Roy. You don't know until you open it. Math, Miracle Jurassic Egg, Crop Circle, Orbital Bombardment, Wonder Garage, Elements Hero Neos, D Spirit, Cyber Summon Blaster. Ooh, okay. We still have five packs left. Five more chances at the legendary Horus, the Black Flame Dragon. I believe that we can pull this. It could change everything. Absolute end. The ultimate baseball kid, Abyssal Designator, Trojan Horse. Oh, Rux and Special. The Sandwich. Two man cell batter. Battle. I always say batter. And then the Ojama King. There he is. He's here to cheer us up. He's like, what up, man? Blah. Yeah, so. Yeah. Okay, I don't think it worked, though. I'm still feeling a little bit sad. Let's see what we can do here. Can we pull something amazing? Will it be epic? Will it be awesome? I believe that it will be. We have the Goblin Calligrapher. Ritual Weapon. Mass Dragon. Malice Doll of Demise. Hate Hane. 
Ninjutsu are a decoy. Howling Insect. Level up. Innervating Mist. Ooh, another rare. Ooh, a rare right in our face. Don't worry. So far, we've pulled the, the Flare Scarab. That's, that's really the big one. That's really about it. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not looking good, guys. This is not looking good. Hope you guys have at least enjoyed, enjoyed the opening because... Oh, there's a bent card. Okay. And then a Luber. Okay, we pulled a couple of those. Those are unfortunately under 10 bucks now. They they went down a lot, but still pretty solid. Soul of the Duelist, you still owe us at least one foil. I think we have five foils. So you owe us at least one more foil. I believe we got the Element Dragon. Oh, Rux and Special. Mass Dragon, Neo Aquamador, Noble Maneater Bug, the Level Up, Red Eyes B Chick, Taunt, and Arm Dragon Level 5. Another cool retail ulti. I pulled that against Yu Gi Mo in like 2018, 2019, a long time ago. Second to last pack. Will it have it? Will it have the amazing Horus the Black Flame Dragon? I believe. Dark Factory. Horus Servant. Yeah, come on. Where's. All right, the Servant's here. Where's the Master? Skull Dog. We got the Arm Dragon. We got the Cemetery Bomb. Noble Maneater. And a Hallowed Life Barrier. No, does that mean we're not even going to get an Ultra? Oh, we're saving that one. It could be in there. We're going to go one more of each pack. Ghost from the Past, Power of the Duelist, and Soul of the Duelist in this thing off. Here we go. Ghost Ray. Let's go. Ooh, okay. Nothing in that one. That's okay. That's okay. Ghost from the Past, not this time. Power of the Duelist. You've been pretty strong, Power of the Duelist. I'll give you that. You've been a, a strong player in today's video. Let's see if you can uh, end it off with another epic pull. We have Sabersaurus. We have Defender. Common Soul. Ambulance Roid. Contact. Wonder Garage. Rescue Roid. Synthetic Seraphim. And a Cyclone Blade. Okay, that all comes down to this. Will this have a level 8? We've pulled four supers, two ultimates. You sometimes get an ultra, you sometimes don't. This is the chance to get it. Here we go. Let's go. Will we pull something amazing? One, two, three, four. Be the Horus, Ultimate Baseball Kid, Abyssal Designator. Oh, another Rux. This is getting bad. It's, you can tell. It's, I'm affected. I'm affected by the pulls. Trojan Horse. I'm, there it is again. Arm Dragon Level 8. We got the Skull Dog Marin. Fusion Weapon. And. We got an Ultra Inferno Fire Blast. Okay, yes, we will take that. This is the Red Eyes thing I was talking about. The Inferno Fire Blast is not an ultimate. It is the Ultra. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting a rare, totally. So when I saw this, I was like, whoa, okay, we'll take this. This is probably at least worth a little bit. I mean, it's definitely better than the ultimates we got, I would say. So overall, I mean, it was pretty bad box, but that was a great pull at the end. So I feel a little bit better about it. And if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic videos like this. Shout out to TCG, Trust Cards, Tomefo Show, Tomato Juice, Daxter, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanda, Squirtle, Flexi Boy, Dizzy, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, John Nolan, and Untai Show, Thomas McLean, and Seth Fisher. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.